Hey everyone, I'm Ricky from Ricky's Tech Talk. Today, Huawei announced the new Huawei MateBook 14S. And I was lucky enough to get some precious hands-on time. First of all, it will be running Windows 11, which also launched today. And very soon, I'm gonna have my own video on Windows 11. The MateBook 14S comes in two colors, space gray and the new spruce green, which is subtle, but looks very professional, or even there for the Instagram famous people or to just have in a coffee shop, but looks very nice and very subtle to the hint of green it uses. Comes in two different configurations, which are 16 gigabytes of RAM and one terabyte storage, or 16 gigabytes of RAM and 512 gigabytes of storage. They are powered by the new Intel 11th generation i7 processor, so very powerful, and they are able to work by day and play by night. So it has passed and used the Intel Evo platform too, which is amazing for gaming and your working day. So you can work by day and play by night and the MateBook will be able to keep on going and keep up with you. The display needs to be seen to really appreciate and there are some really nice images that I've got as well as there are other images out there, but you really have to see this display to actually enjoy it, but here are the details. It's a 2.5K Huawei full view display, has over a billion colors, has 90% screen to body ratio, so you're gonna get loads of screen, very minimal bezels. It offers 3.2 screen ratio, so a real nice fit for ratio there. 400 nits of brightness, not too sure what its peak brightness is. Has 90 hertz refresh rate, so able to keep up with fast motion and moving through either your apps or even moving through games, being Windows 11, Game Pass will be able to work. It has a full 10 point touch screen display too, so you're able to touch your display and navigate that way around if you want to. Here are some extras that I picked up from today. It has AI noise cancellation, so for when you're in team calls, you're the only person that should be heard, which I think is important, but not your child coming in and asking something or even your partner saying the dinner's ready. You just want the person on that call to hear you. So AI noise cancellation. I think that's a really good thing to see here and I'm looking forward to maybe testing that out if we manage to get a review model. They have also removed the camera, which I think is a real improvement. The camera was hidden away for privacy, which is really good in a key along the keyboard. However, they've moved it back up to the top bezel. Huawei has updated the speakers. It has a quad speaker system. Sounds really good. I couldn't really get too much sound where I was today because it was a busy environment. However, I did manage to use the keyboard and it has a 1.5 millimeter high key travel keyboard which is really nice and a natural feeling and found typing very easy. So the battery they say is up to 13 hours of battery life. This depends on what you're doing. And again, it would be better to have in hand to really test out and see how well it performs. It offers 90 watt compact supercharger, which comes in the box. And with just 15 minutes of charging, you'll get up to three hours of full usage, depending on what you want to do and completely fully charged in just over an hour or just on an hour they say again it needs to be tested to see it also offers huawei share which you're able to sync and share images so fast and easily between compatible devices and your mate's book series again i've used this in the past and it is really nice to just share your images or even see what's on your phone as well you can tap your phone on the trackpad your phone will come up and you're able to see your phone. The important question is price and availability. So the price for the Huawei MateBook 14S starts at 1,199, but I recommend going for their more spec model as you'll get the one terabyte of SSD storage, 16 gigabytes of RAM, and that includes the Intel Evo platform certification for £1,299, which is only £100 more. And I really recommend going for that one if you are in the market for a new laptop. You're able to pre-order the new Huawei MateBook 14S from now, and it dispatches around the 27th of October. And currently at the moment, there are some pretty good pre-order bonuses. So I recommend going and checking out the Huawei UK link in the video description. So my question ending this short little video is, what do you think of the new Huawei MateBook 14S? 
And would you be getting one? Is it something you are interested in? And let me know what you would maybe like to see in my review video. So make sure to leave a comment below and remember if you haven't already, subscribe and ring that notification bell to stay updated when I release my latest videos. And make sure to give this video a like too as it does really help. For me Ricky, thank you for watching and I will see you in my next video.